The fiberglass Ranger Pro fisherman boat is registered to Chase Kaminsky of Hermitage. Investigators say he was involved in the scandal. He and his partner, Jacob Runyon of Cleveland, could face criminal charges in both Ohio and Pennsylvania. What is up, guys, and welcome back. We got a walleye cheater update for you. The Lake Erie walleye scandal has blown up on social media. It has gone national and international. I've done some, some videos on it. Chase Kaminsky and Jake Runyon are infamous at this point. Pretty much everybody in the country knows who they are and outside of the country. Guaranteed every single fisherman pretty much on the planet has heard their name at this point. And we got an update for you guys. There has been some new developments in the case. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, I don't know if you guys have been living under a rock, but Jake Runyon and Chase Kaminsky cheated at a Lake Erie Walleye Trail Championship, also called Loot. But it was the loot championship. We got weights and fish. There we go. And they had placed weights inside the bellies of their walleye, adding a total of eight pounds to their bag. And they got caught at the weigh-in because the tournament director felt something odd in the walleye and decided to cut them open in front of everybody. And everybody became very irritated and basically turned into an angry mob. Chase Kaminsky ran to his car, left his partner out there to fend for himself, while everybody pretty much ripped into him. Amazingly, nobody assaulted him. The tournament director, I believe his name was Jason Fisher, did a great job of collecting himself and then calming everyone down so that no one was no one was hurt. Because you could tell that they really wanted to get a hold of Jake Runyon. So yeah, it's been almost two weeks now. Nothing new has really happened until yesterday. So Chase Kaminsky lives in Hermitage, PA. Jake Runyon lives in, uh, I believe, Cleveland. But yeah, Kaminsky lives in Hermitage, PA. And his boat and trailer were just seized by authorities. So the Ohio Department of Natural Resources, along with the Mercer County Sheriff's Department, showed up to Chase Kaminsky's house with a search warrant and seized his boat and trailer. Now, this is the boat that he won last year, and everybody's speculating that he probably cheated during that tournament, too, to win the boat, which is probably pretty likely going by just like all the all the evidence and all the new stuff that's been coming up and everyone suspected them to be cheating for a while so that's probably pretty likely that he did in fact cheat to win the boat but yeah they took the property for evidence so they're both facing charges at this point i don't know for a fact that if charges have been filed i in one of my previous videos i said that they were arrested and that's because usa today actually reported that they were arrested and they took it down several hours later after I'd already made my video and I used them as a source. So my bad guys, my bad. They haven't technically been arrested yet. But it's looking like things are moving that way. Why else would they come seize the boat? I think they seized some other property too. I'm gonna go ahead and play a little clip from the, the, the local news station there and you guys can kind of see like them taking the boat and stuff. Was used to cheat in a Lake Erie fishing tournament last month. Mercer County's district attorney and the Ohio Department of Natural Resources obtained the warrant earlier today. Ranger Pro Fisherman Boat is registered to Chase Kaminsky of Hermitage. He and his partner, Jacob Runyon of Cleveland, could face criminal charges in both Ohio and Pennsylvania. Cuyahoga County Prosecutor's Office contacted Mercer County DA Pete Acker last week to assist in getting the warrant. We work cooperatively with our partners. It's Cuyahoga County Prosecutor's Office or ODNR or any other law enforcement agency. The district Attorney's Office will be using the boat and trailer as evidence in this ongoing investigation. So yeah, guys, I'm not really sure. Like, you know, they're taking the boat. I don't know if they're taking the boat because they suspect that he cheated when he won the boat. I mean, they've won a ton of tournaments. You know, I was looking stuff up. They've won, they've won a lot in the last couple of years. So I, I don't know if they're going to try and determine whether they cheated at these other tournaments and that's why they're seizing the boat or if they're just seizing the boat to just be like hey like we're looking at you guys just to, you know get them squirming a little bit trying to get them to confess to it all but yeah this is pretty interesting guys according to the search warrant it they, they're also being investigated by the rossford police department for allegations that they also cheated in a tournament back in april 22nd so it looks like they're definitely trying to get them for more than just the one charge i don't know about you guys but I'm pretty happy that it seems like they're going to be pursuing this pretty aggressively because a lot of cheaters get away with it. A lot of cheaters 
not necessarily get away with it, but they get like a slap on the wrist. Some do just straight up get away with it. But it's looking like they're going to try and go after Kaminsky and run in pretty hard. Hopefully throw the book at him and make an example out of them so that people don't try this in the future. But yeah, guys, comment below. Let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you think. I wonder if they're going to let Kaminsky get the boat back after the investigation. Because it's probably going to be really hard to prove that he cheated in that tournament. Because that was last year. So if they can only prove that he cheated in other tournaments, I wonder how that works. I wonder if they're going to let him keep the boat. But who knows what they're going to find on that boat. They might find some other incriminating stuff. Man, I can't. I guarantee it's probably they probably came and got that boat. And as soon as they left, I bet you Kaminsky was calling Runyon. And they're probably just, they're probably scared, man. They are probably tripping right now. But yeah, guys, I'm going to continue to try and stay on top of this. Any new developments. I probably won't make another video until they get arrested. Like, actually get arrested or unless something crazy happens. But they got them, guys. The walleye cheaters are going down. And it looks like they're going to go down pretty freaking hard. Because they clearly have enough evidence to get them for cheating at that last loot event. And they're wanting, they look for more. It's pretty obvious that they are wanting more. I don't think the ODNR plays around, guys. They take this stuff pretty seriously, especially especially in the manner that they are cheating. But yeah, guys, that is all I have for you. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button, hit the like button, and I'll see you next time. Stop, motherfucker! Call the fucking cop! Everybody listen to me right now. Everybody listen to me right now. Jake, I want you to leave. I don't want anybody to touch these guys. I want you to leave. You need to go to jail. Tell the cop. It's tough. It's tough. You fucking. This is bullshit. You fucking dumb this motherfucker. You fucking piece of shit. Don't we need to file a police report? Yeah. Jason, we got to file a police report. All of them. All of them. I mean, we all fucking knew it. What the fuck, man? A filet fish. Look at this. Is a filet, yeah. A filet fish. a walleye filet. He needs to go to jail. You have anything to say, Jerry? You call the cops. I got video. You got anything to say? Hey, you guys do what you want. We fuck all that fucking money. You fucking talk shit to me, dude. And that's what you fucking do? How many fucking ways are in there? You fucking scum. You fucking piece of shit. Take pictures. I need pictures. You videoing this whole thing? Got video. Yeah. I videoed it right off the rail. Hold on, let me take pictures. You fucked over a lot of people, man.